This is the Boca 2. This is actually the second video of this Boca 2 model by Dreamfinders Homes in Shearwater. This is the first look ever that the public is seeing of this actual model and I'm excited to be sharing this with you. Let's go upstairs. So if you're wondering what the tour of all of that is like, that was on the first video I shot. Oh man. So if you don't know, my wife just had baby number six just a few weeks ago. And so naturally I, I gained the sympathy weight along with her. And anytime I go up just a small sissy flight of stairs like that, I get a little, a little out of breath. Welcome to uh, being 40 years old with six kids, right? <sighs> All right, let me catch my breath. You guys hang with me. Okay, air conditioning closet upstairs. Pro tip, pro tip, pro tip. You definitely want them to um, put tile in your air conditioning closet. You don't want your carpet going through there. This is also a drainage pan. So if any, for any reason, the condensation line gets backed up and this starts filling with water, there's a floater here that once the water fills up, that floater will trigger a mechanism to cut the unit off. Ugh, still out of breath. Sorry, gang. <laughs> Hang with me. Less, uh, less chili cheese dogs, Josh. Get a grip, right? But um, that way your AC won't flood upstairs and then ruin the, the, the ceiling downstairs. All right. This is an outstanding room, everybody. What a home run. This is tremendous. Welcome to walk-in closet and your very own full bathroom. Can you imagine, gosh, if you're a teenager and your parents hook them up with this suite, this is insane. Like you're ruining them for life. <laughs> the teenager will never be able to replicate this the rest of their life. I love it. So this is the upstairs full on. This could be a, a secondary master suite with as big as this is. This so could be a game room, it could be an office, it could be a fitness area, it could be a homeschool room, it could be an in-law suite, teenager suite, it could be the doghouse. Gosh, this is great. Hey, while we're, while we're hanging together, actually, why don't we go out and see the backyard? Just kind of see the covered lanai. There's a lot of pro tips that I'd like to share with you with the lanai, but... Woo! <laughs> This house is great. This is great. <clears throat> okay, cool. Let's check it out. First of all, triple slider. That collapses on itself. And then, and when you get these, when you get these tracks cleaned, the slider actually is very light and easy to move. But it all collapses on itself right there and it really makes it nice for those, those key months of say March for us, March, November, December, get this screen die, screened lanai, and then leave these things open and it's gonna be really nice. Let's go ahead and close this. Now, the other thing that I really like is if you hang outside a lot, or if you have a pool, or if the kids are coming in and, out, in and out, in and out, in and out, having this door is super handy, rather than sliding open, sliding back, back and open, back and open. You can really just come through here. Use the restroom going in and out, bringing food in and out, drinks in and out. The door makes it so much more convenient than the slider, right? Hey, so some, this is a really good perspective. Check this out, this gives you an idea. The Boca 2 is such a big footprint. Look how small the yard is back here. 
it stops right there where the end of the St. Augustine grass is. So you say, hey Josh, on this lot, can it fit a pool? The answer is no, this lot cannot. Great little um, outdoor kitchen. I actually like how this bar comes out because it kind of frames in this as a room. What I would highly recommend, spend the extra money to expand the pavers out and then have a screen go up like a nice big cage, screen up and over and you're just literally expanding your space of enjoyment. Because standing on pavers, just trust me, the St. Augustine grass is coarse and it's thick. And it's unlikely you're just gonna just be hanging out here, standing around in the grass. If you bring out pavers, you're gonna use it more. It's just a fact. All right, cool. So uh, the third video is going to be the master suite. I'm excited. Let's see what that master bathroom looks like. Is it going to be like a spa or kind of be a little plain and boring? I don't know. Um, thanks for hanging with me. Appreciate you guys. Let's keep this conversation going. All right. I'm a real guy. You text me myself or my team, my partners is going to reach out to you, answer your questions. I love brainstorming and just really kind of helping you guys save time and frustration. We help families like you every single day and it's really, really fun. I'll see you in the next video.